keep in mind uh, as we think about social distancing, six feet might not be enough. That is the warning today from a group of scientists sending to the World Health Organization, and the message now has reached the White House. Denver 7's Jessica Porter spoke to several researchers who say this virus spreads through every breath an infected person takes. For weeks, we've been advised to maintain six feet of social distance from others to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Physical distancing practices are strictly followed. That we're doing enough, that we're taking the bold actions necessary. The mitigation that we're doing right now is having an effect. But some experts say that may not be enough. So what I'm doing myself is I'm keeping 25 feet from, from anyone. A group of 37 scientists, including CU Boulder chemistry professor Jose Jimenez, sent a letter to the World Health Organization about the effectiveness of six feet of social distancing. Jimenez says the virus could spread even more when people are exercising. When you talk instead of just plain breathing, or when you sing or do something where the air is coming out of your lungs more strongly, then more particles are generated. So more viruses are gonna end up in the air. Other researchers have similar findings. It's not fair to assume that if you put six people in a room and you, you know, measure out six feet between every person, that there's no chance that you're gonna contract it from one person who came into that room and might have the virus. Joshua Santerpia, a professor of microbiology at the University of Nebraska Medical Center, found air samples taken in the hallway of quarantined patients tested positive for COVID-19. Santerpia and other researchers are still trying to determine how contagious those air samples are. But what they learned did change how doctors at the University of Nebraska Medical Center treat COVID-19 patients. We would wear PPE as we went into the room and out of the room and into the next room and out of the next room. And as we started looking at the results of the study, one of the things we've changed is that we now doff all of our surface PPE, everything except respiratory protection, as we leave the room. Jessica Porter, Denver 7.